check out this restaurant. This is a restaurant that is about an hour and a half from Reykjavik, but it's kind of like off the map. If you're actually doing the ring road or if you're going to do all of the waterfalls in one day, then this is a place where you kind of want to go because it's kind of in that vicinity. It's a super cute, unique dining experience in a greenhouse, in a tomato greenhouse. And basically they grow all of their tomatoes. They have like rows and rows and rows of tomatoes. And then they set up a little dining experience. And it was just one of those really cool, kind of once in a lifetime, kind of unique experiences to experience in Iceland. Everything on the menus from the soup to the sandwiches to the salads to the drinks even, even alcoholic drinks, everything is grown and made from tomatoes. It's really crazy. It's really cool. So this is kind of like the walkway. The parking lot is a little bit further away from the actual greenhouse and then there's a little walkway where they have some horses. They actually have and chickens. <laughs> During certain times of the seasons, we went in November, so they weren't really offering anything at the moment, but they do have uh, pony shows and horse shows. They also have greenhouse tours and those kind of tours. These are actually show horses, so they are pretty picky about like going and touching them or whatever, but you can definitely go and take some cute photos and they are quite friendly. So as you keep walking, this is kind of where the dining experience is. That is the greenhouse, but the main like dining experience is just straight ahead right here and then behind us obviously you can see the lights of the greenhouse it's such a cool little cute dining cozy oh my god everything about it was really adorable and cute and let's go into the restaurant <laughs> I was trying to get it on camera, but I wasn't quick enough. The waitress, actually, when you're waiting, standing and waiting for your table, they actually come up to you with like this block that says your name on it and they ask for that reservation and then they take you to your table and then you're greeted with some water. They have butter, sour cream and this like cucumber stuff. And then they actually have a plant, like a basil plant because it's a tomato restaurant dining experience. So like they have the most famous uh, tomato soup so then you can just literally pluck off the basil and throw it into your soup but we got the happy mary which was it's one part gin two parts healthy mary which is actually like a bloody mary made with green tomatoes and this is what it looks like stirring. yeah she recommended stirring so there's a little cucumber in here and stir it as you drink it let's try it out cheers Wow, it's so tomatoey. You don't expect it. I don't know, it's weird. It's good. Yeah, it's like a gin fizz with tomato. It's really good. So then we're also getting the tomato soup which they have two different stations and it's pretty much a buffet help yourself so let's go do that so this was the tomato soup station they have the soup they had fresh like freshly baked kind of bread with a little bit of cheese on top and the soup smelled and looked absolutely delicious so here is the butter the sour cream and what was this like a cucumber salsa salsa and then they have this really yummy looking homemade baked like cheesy bread. Well, it's like the crust is cheesy. And this is the tomato soup. Looks delicious, smells delicious. Do you like tomato and basil? <laughs> yeah, so they have little basil plants here. You can just throw it in your soup. So what do you think of the tomato soup? That's great. Yes, it's really good. It actually has a little bit of a kick to it. Um, but other than that, it's beautiful. It's amazing. Try with the basil. It's very good. Okay. Well. Okay. We also ordered a couple skewers. They have a chicken, a shrimp, or a cheese. So I got the cheese one, and then David got the shrimp. No way my dessert just came in a terracotta pot. That is the cutest thing I've ever seen. Um, I got tomato ice cream. And David, what did you get? 
uh, apple tomato pie. Apple tomato pie, and that is <laughs> whipped cream. Like, how gorgeous. This place also had a full service bar. So if you're wanting to just go for coffee or a cocktail or a shot or anything, you just walk up to the bar and they have seating kind of in a bar lounge area. And this is just David showing you the coffee station. So there's coffee, there was hot water, oat milk, cow's milk, and then they had all their teas and sugars there. And then they had a Bloody Mary station, which I thought was really cool. Uh, so they have the Tabasco, the salt, the pepper, and all the things you need to make a spicy Bloody Mary.